Hi guys, welcome to a new video. Kindly bear with my bare face. I did my eyebrows, so that area is red. I have no makeup on and I'm at home and I'm about to have a manicure pedicure session. Actually, my feet are like three weeks old since I did my last mani uh, pedicure session and this time I have to do it because I have like hurting feet and my feet seem to be kind of worn out worn out is a term for your feet i don't know but my feet feel tired my nails are terrible so they need some attention and i have kept water for heating we are going to pour the water in my collapsible tub add some baking soda some shampoo some apple cider vinegar and epsom salt to relax the muscles you know how it goes so without wasting any time we will just get with the nails we will just soak our feet first and then we will choose our favorite nail paint and we'll go about with that so without wasting any time let's get into the video but for that if you're new to my channel don't fail to subscribe hit that notification bell give your support to my channel i have posted around 80 plus videos you can check my channel and the videos that are lined up in my channel collapsible tub I'm just going to open it up this collapsible tub does come with four rollers I broke this roller because I stood on it and it was my body weight could not handle it it couldn't handle my body weight so that thing broke because of me otherwise the collapsible tub does come with uh, four rollers this was something asked by a close friend because I made a video on at home spa items and that is where my friend noticed there was no one roller was missing but in total four rollers in this collapsible tub. I'm going to fill this tub with hot water and then we are going to get with soaking my feet in this tub. Okay so before we begin with pouring hot water in I'm just going to add my solid ingredients solid uh, whatever things that need to be diluted first up I'm adding my Epsom salt this is something you do once a week so I'm going to take a generous amount of Epsom salt my container is like quarter the quantity is remaining in this container I need to stock up with this this is something really good for your feet and overall your muscle health it's really amazing soaking in your mus uh, your muscles into this you know dilute into this epsom salt diluted in water is really amazing for your muscles the next thing i'm going to do just going to eyeball some baking soda baking soda is really amazing uh, you know it's a cleansing agent it's really amazing for baking as well as as a cleansing agent So once I have added baking soda, I'm going to add this, I don't know if you can see. This is a shower gel but it leaves kind of like a cast, cast as in it uh, leaves a slight oily residue so I have to keep pouring water on my body so instead of using it as a body wash, I use it as a foot soak because it does have tea tree oil, tea tree oil is amazing for you know it has antibacterial properties so this smells like tea tree oil it does have an essence of tea tree oil so i'm going to keep this now i'm going to get some hot water pour it in and then we are going to soak my feet For the time being, I'm going to pull my tub aside and I'm going to just take off my nail paint. Okay, so this is what my feet look like. This is what my tired feet look like and I'm going to just take off my nail paint. I don't use a nail polish remover, I just find acetone really 
I don't know, Essadon compar comparatively does a better job than a nail polish remover. I don't have to rub as much. I just press it on my nails and it takes it off. So I'm going to use the clean side just to remove the rest of the residue of my nail paint. My nails are clean and I'm just going to chop this off. We can go in voiceover mode now. Apparently, I'm wearing my mic. I'm going to take it off and we'll go in voiceover mode because usually I don't like really talking when I'm doing this. But just for video's sake, I'm doing the talking. For now, voiceover mode. I'm going to start off with cutting my nails and filing them taking off all the dirt that is accumulated under my nails and all that sort of shit that is there here i'm using my toenail cutter to chip off all of that excess nail that is there so that you know uh, i don't face any issue with excess nail excess nail can dig into your uh, muscles and it can cause some pain or even infection so we are going to chip off all of that excess nail step is filing but I couldn't really file my nails because they weren't soft enough the nails have to soften up so that I can file better so we are going to follow up with my foot soak which is the whole point of this video and once we are done my nails should feel soft and tender and now I'm going with the file again so you know we have that smooth clear cut results with the nails the nails need to look prim and proper pedicure doesn't just finish with uh, cutting the nails and you know that that's not just the job of it we need to remove all that excess dry cuticle that is there around the nails so that is what i am doing you will see how much grim dirt and dry skin i take off i'm filling the pad with that whole thing right you can see the pad all the dirt and grime i'm sticking on that pad and here is the cuticle remover and now i'm using my pumice stone this is the lava pumice stone which is used to remove the excess dry skin that is there around your feet beneath your feet and i rub a little on my uh, toes even because my toes are kind of dark and dry so i rub a little on my toes too especially the last two small toes finally i'm buffing my nails i need that smooth and shiny finish on my nails my nails, nails need to look shiny so i'm buffing the nails i know some people like to use fake nails on the top they like to glue on fake nails i like to work with my natural nails i do have very good nails they are like hard and sturdy nails they are they don't chip off that easily so i work with them itself and lastly i take something that pokes inside my nails so that i can remove that excess grime and dirt that is there on the inside and whatever nail that is you know on the sides i take that off also so that doesn't cause any issue it doesn't dig into my flesh so i do that too over here I go with a very neutral tone nail paint this is a pastel green color which I really like and I'm going to paint that all over I'm not using a base coat nor a top coat I directly apply that nail paint you can use a base coat and a top coat it's up to you I just find this a better option once I have buffed my nails the application is all smooth and it is not all that bumpy and you know layered this is what my feet look like once i have done my manicure 
मैट पेडिक्यूर आई मीन दे लुक क्लीन बेकिंग सोडा डज अ वेरी गुड जॉब अलॉन्ग विद एप्स एम सॉट एंड सम यू कैन यूज योर शैम्पू और अ बॉडी वॉश आई यूज बॉडी वॉश बिकॉज आई डोंट रियली लाइक यूजिंग इट ऑन माई बॉडी सो आई हैव केप्ट इट एज अ फूड सोक एंड दिस इज वॉट माई फीट लुक लाइक ओके यू गाइज आई होप यू लाइक दिस वीडियो इफ यू लाइक दिस वीडियो हिट द लाइक बटन डोंट फील टू सब्सक्राइब हिट दैट नोटिफिकेशन बेल आई पोस्ट वन से वीक एंड लाइक आई हैव सेट इन द बिगिनिंग ऑफ द वीडियो Plus videos lined up. You can check those videos too. Click whatever video you like, whatever suits your port, and support my channel. Until then, bye.